It's not that we want to be the first. We just want to push boundaries. We just want to do amazing things that haven't been done before. Contrast is what defines us. It's, it's the raw, rustic, derelict location mixed with the luxury Michelin star food. One should expect the unexpected because it's never done, been done before. Pretty Dene is a food collection and Coughlin Company is a catering firm and this is like entering the London uh, market. Doing something like uh, Pretty Dene in an environment in the underground of London, bringing Michelin star chefs here, uh, working with the Flatteridas, have all the artists here. Uh, that's really a great uh, thing. It's, we say it's not a pop-up restaurant, it's also a dining experience. A few years ago, Banksy had invited me down to this street art exhibition and I found a door and it wasn't locked very well and I gave it a kick and I discovered 25,000 square foot of underground tunnels that have been abandoned for 20 years and I decided that this should be a kind of crazy performance space. Steve Lazaridi is bringing together an amazing collection of artists from all over the globe that are doing stuff that's incredibly exciting and then you know the efficiency of the German catering champion KP Koffler and company just yeah it's magic well some idiot decided to introduce me and KP to each other and I think you know it's a match made in hell we're both completely insane so I've decided to make our lives very difficult by coming to do something here. Because of the nature of the tunnels, it lends itself to installation and video works rather than just purely two-dimensional works. A few of them are artists that I represent and others are friends and family that sometimes we don't get to work with but that we can pull in to work on a big exhibition like this. It's a whole kind of cross-section of the artists that we work with. We are always looking um, for new chefs and uh, also new ideas and we invite um, new chefs to join us at Petit Dene. Um, tonight here we have for example Oli San which is for me one of the best uh, sushi chefs in uh, Germany. To do a menu for a concept like this is not so easy because you have to be um, carefully what you're doing by, um, because so many people will come in here yeah we are uh, I think we almost like overbooked, so this means we have like 200 guests every day and you want to do something special, something nice, but you have to do it good. So I took once the basics from the Japanese and took all the kitchen around the world and tried to create something new. For the near future we'll go to Munich in an old film theater, which is very nice. We go back to Berlin during Berlin Film Festival and uh, Fashion Week. It seems we'll do another three, four uh, during the year and maybe, maybe we come back to London during the Olympics. <laughs>